Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Night Witches. So if you didn't watch the last episode, I suggest you go back and watch it. We lost the pilot. Red Comet died via headshot by Long Tom Artillery. Yes, I'll say that again. Headshot by Long Tom Artillery. And I thought taking a... Uh, um, in this, like She's the second pilot that's died. I thought taking a uh, uh, large heavy laser to the head... Um, like we did in um, Jade Falcon Freeborn was bad, but long time to the head is probably the worst thing that could possibly happen to a pilot. At least, if you didn't see it coming, I mean, it would be painless. That's my guess. Uh, regardless, I mean, we lost Red Comet, um, but we did gain another <laughs> cool pilot called Hot Dam. Uh, now her, she's going to take over for Red Comet eventually, most likely. Uh, but right now, we're going to bring Satori up into the main lance. Uh, Diva, if we get the second lance up and running, we'll we'll take over uh, as a pilot in the second lance. But until Hot Tam gets some experience, there's just no point in uh, putting her in the game. So that being said, we have jumped planets. Uh, we're at Ortho now. We just jumped over one system. Uh, it was only a 13-day jump. We were here. Awana, we jumped over to Ortho here. Um, good world, it's hard to climb it, so we'll just stay nice and cool in the, in the combats, uh, which is great. Uh, we got some good contracts here. Uh, the goal is to try and not so much get salvage, but get sea bills. So we're going to work towards that. Now I did sell it. We were at just around nine hundred thousand uh, at the end of last, last episode. I sold a whole bunch of stuff, not a whole bunch, but a bunch of other stuff that we had that we had lying around. We had a couple of just regular XL engines that I got rid of. Um, I don't like, like running XL engines uh, in Inner Sphere Max. I like the Clown XL engines because they kind of work like a regular Inner Sphere light engine. I, I, I prefer the light engine um, just because you don't lose the mech if you lose a side. Um, and I've lost sides on many occasions and I'd rather not have the whole thing go down. So that's just kind of the way the, the way I play. Anyway, so I sold a couple of XL engines and a bunch of other extra parts that we had lying around. So we've got a bit of funds going on here. So we're on our way to getting that Black Knight restored. Um, so let's just jump right into a contract. Now we've got to protect the mech contract here. I think I want to take this one. It's the Three Skull. There's a few others that we could do. Um, intelligence Agent. Uh, I don't know about Drop Interception. Uh, it's local pirates, so anything can happen with pirates. Uh, but we definitely want to try to three protect the mech. Um, protect the mechs. This should be relatively easy. 521 salvage. We're going to negotiate. I think we're going to go right up the center. It's a nice balance uh, and accept this. And we'll bring in Satori. And let's deploy and get this done. Alright. So we were able to stay, <laughs> excuse me, we were able to stay camouflaged um, basically last mission. Uh, due to a couple of reasons. Um, one, the NSS system and the um, void systems that we have running on our mechs work great if you move less than five hexes. Uh, if you move any more than that, um, then you lose the uh, bonus. So I think what happened, I was I wasn't sprinting because I was moving really slowly. They had no idea I was there until I got close enough to fire. Good to go. Um, which we're going to test out again here. Now, I could fire. I'm not going to. I just want to see how close we can get. Just by moving slowly and bracing. Let's just move. Yeah. I mean, most likely we'll be able to overwhelm these guys. Yeah, they can't see us. So it's it, it is the speed. We got a wolfhound, trebuchet, a ghost, and a marshal. Marshal McLuhan. Um, ER medium ghost rifle. No idea because he's ghosted. Ha 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 ha. And it's the short range trebuchet. So as long as we're moving slow enough, we should be like non visible. Oh, yeah, let's pay this guy a visit. What is up? Do we want to try? 
Uh, let's just see if we can take his freaking head clean off. I mean, it's no long Tom, but... Nah, we should have just fired. Oh well. Order. It's a 44 Magnum. Most powerful handgun in the world. I copy. I was able to take your head clean off. Alright, let's just target this guy. Ready for orders. I don't think they can see us. I don't think you can see a damn thing. Let's swarm it up on this guy, do some good damage. It's only going to do four. Okay, it up. Firing. I copy. I hear ya. Do you? At least somebody's listening to me. Let's put acid on him as well. And firing on A. Yeah, I wish. Okay, we got some acid on there. Oh, they did get a headshot. <laughs> they still can't see us. <laughs> we should just stand here and shoot at them. Oh my god, I lost my targeting now. Because you've just moved in front of me. That's like taboo, like number, like... The biggest taboo you can do is move into somebody else's firing solution. Standing by. Do not move into somebody's firing solution. Receiving. See if we can get in range of those ERs. Sure can. Keep him tagged up. Nice. We're taking a long time to kill people here. Gonna do the same thing. This guy's already got acid on him, so switch back to LK. Firing. Nicely done. They can't see us. They cannot see us. Voids in NSS, people. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Okay, so uh, suggestions to the rogue tech modders. Um, if a mech is being targeted um, and it cannot see the enemy, at least have it move somewhere. Even if it just moves backwards. I don't know if that's programmable or not. But if someone's being shot at like that, they should be moving. Think I hit something. You would know, I mean, think about it. Anybody would know that, right? Well, I guess anybody, any good pilot would know that. That, hit something good. that guy's taking a hell of a punishment here. Now, eventually they'll see us, but still. Uh -huh. Ah, I finally killed him. When I shoot you, you'll take it and like it. Yeah, so my biggest folly then was, um... In the first episode I played was running. Just don't run. Okay, we got tag on, that's all that matters. Now, at some point they might they might spot us, but as it stands right now, oh, yeah. target's taking a critical hit. Um, I'm not sure who it was. Someone was mentioning how frustrated they were with Rogue Tech. Um, I, I I you know I get it. Uh, it can be frustrating, but um, wow. But it's just experimenting, finding the right balance, what works for you. Stealth is like a huge deal now. I mean, it was before, but it's even bigger now, right? I read you, Commander. Moving out. 
Now's the time for the warlord. Yeah, what about some dead fire? Wow, that really bad chance to hit, eh? Okay, so LKs and acid. And firing. Still can't see us. Warlord's already back. Well, he's a stick. Oh, gonna save the ammo. Waiting on you, Commander. On my way. Gonna save the ammo. Uh huh. If it was just these two guys that we were fighting, another hit like that, and you're toast. Then that would be fine, but I think we gotta have more. All right, about to break stealth. Just for the kill. Got it. There we go. One left target. Still can't see us. Standing by. Should be able to now. Location confirmed. What's up, buddy? Uh Got eight turns of LRMs left. Let's just save them. Got it. That was a CT hit, it looked like. This guy didn't move, so let's see if we can core him. CT hits. I hear ya. Uh huh. How much you got left? Ah, a fair bit. We can take care of that though. With a little bit of this. Well, not quite enough. Oh, of course, handful of points left. Wow. Save some ammo. Conserving ammo. Just conserving ammo now. Ready for orders. My right, girl, kills all yours. Now you're starved for kills now. Locked on start. You did taking a bit of a dirt nap. Well, I guess a snow nap in this case. It's what making snow angels. Oh, I don't have enough. Ah, oh, well. Not quite that fast anymore. Alright, so let's move the bushwhackers. Ooh, that's a lot of fire. Commander. I'm interested to see how that messes with the vehicles. Roger. Let's get the whackers up here. Order. Let's get positioned here. Roger that. Dirty heat from fire, eh? Good thing to know. Waiting on you, Commander. Moving out. All right, let's get this convoy moving. I 
We got targets. Alright, what do we got here? Rapier, Goblin, Raven. This is their first turn in. Uh, I don't know if they can see us. Waiting for orders. Let's get out of the fire. Moving to position. What can I do for you? How far up can you go? Let's get up to here. Going turbo. So we got an Orion, catapult, blackjack. Warhammer. All right. Standing by. Move real slow. What else do we got here? Crab. Okay. Taking a risk here, not moving, or not firing. Just interested to see what's going to happen. Yeah, they're not shooting. What's up, boss? Heading out. Waiting for orders. Now I want to move a little bit, just because I don't know if they're eventually going to spot us. Engaging. And I'm just going to run with energy for now. See what happens. So, a thought would be, if you're planning on running um, a distance build like I've kind of got here, um, thinking about <clears throat> having enough ammo to be able to run it, if you're using weapons that require ammo, like AC2s or AC5s or something, um, just making sure you got enough ammo to be able to successfully pull off what you want to do here. You betcha. Um, <clears throat> right now I'm, I got the LRM-15s and I've got, what, eight rounds of LRMs left. They can easily get burned up. So I'm just being really careful not to burn it up. I don't even know what the last lance will be that we're fighting against. Yeah, fire. the fire is migrating. Kind of cool. Alright, if it's not doing anything, we'll take advantage of it. Just stand there and die. So, is it making the game easy mode? Um, yes. Yes and no. I think it would really depend on who you choose to fight all the time. If your if your choice is to be always fight, fighting above tier, okay, get started on that crab. Um, if the if the if the plan is to always be fighting above tier, then I would say no, it's not overpowered. If you're fighting below tier, uh, the only reason really why I'm fighting below tier right now is because we need C bills. But once we get enough sea bills to get our proper lance up and running how I want it to run, we will not be taking these low missions anymore. Our second lance will, but our main lance won't. Okay, that's that guy gone. But like I said, mod developers, get these mechs moving. If they're being shot at, they should always move. And if they can't see the opponent, Either do a side move or a back move, like move backwards, or close. Try and attempt to close with the enemy. That can be more deadly than it's than it's actually worth. The idea is to move back and get behind cover. Man, these guys are going to take forever to get where they're going. Not even at the river yet. Stand there and die. Uh, I don't want to move too close. Let's just move up one. Commander. So 
So let's move down. Let's keep our tags on this guy. Firing. Okay, nice. So yeah, the other thing too is the command console. Um, well, it is six tons. It's I think it's way worth that weight, especially now being able to target your like see your enemy before they can see you visually gives you a huge advantage. The initiative bonus and the resolve gain is a huge advantage. Um, I'm interested to see how effective it is later on. Um, well, this guy's been headshot once already. So wh what I mean by that is if he's going to be, um, if it's going to be um, viable to run command console on everybody. Or just on the, sorry, on the Lance in, in its entirety later on in the game. Oh, he's finally moving. Finally saying, damn man, I had enough of this. It's only so long you can stand there for. Not that he's going to get away. Did he take another headshot? Oh. He's probably got his... His command... What? The... the uh, must have a torso mounted cockpit. Most likely that's what the case is. Most likely. Targeting rear armor. Yeah. Standing by. Roger that. Firing at the Wow, that's a lot of hits. Solid connection on that one. It was. What can I do for you? All right, let's get down to the water. Keep Got these it. mechs moving. Targeting enemy so once I kill this lance, I'll uh, cut to the what end when the first mech goes out. They ain't never gonna stand still. Look at the fire. It's awesome. Yes, Commander. I don't know whether they're moving just because the enemy lance or what that's all about. Let's go with some swarm in this guy's backside. Wow, I missed the PPC, eh? Critical hit, Commander. Well, he's gone. Dead fire explosion. Wow, you got your back turned. That's a lot of missiles. I guess they're probably moving because they can maybe see these guys on sensors. Maybe? I don't know. Probably. They can finally see the enemy, our... our guards on uh, sensors. Can we get, we can't get a direct line, but that's fine. Don't need a direct line of sight on this guy. Let's just see if we can finish him up. Not quite. Alright. There we go. Direct line of sight, firing. Confirmed. NSS is destroyed. That is See, his NSS, I don't know, it wasn't working. Order. Not as well as ours. Maybe it's just because of the piloting or something? I don't know. Maybe. I can't think why they can't see us, but we can see them. It can't be just piloting. Wow, you're really accurate, those medium lasers. Finally crossing the river. So the goblins we can get talons and stuff from. I'm hoping that we can uh, on you, 
Commander. do some precision strikes on this guy. Uh, let's stay out of this Lance's way. If we can. Yeah, I pot shot him. Here we go. Never know. Systems recycling for another shot. Yeah, here he comes. Little prick. He's gonna spot us now for sure. Commander. Let's not get within his melee range, please, and thank you. Giving us a better chance using the swarm. I hear ya. You betcha. Yeah, not in range of the uh, SRMs yet, huh? That's interesting. What are you shooting at? Uh-huh. Okay, now this guy's damaged where? That torso. We can't move far enough to uh, make it worthwhile trying to stay out of this guy's gun sight. But we're going to do this, see if we can take this torso out. Wow. He turned away from us, that's why. That's that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Ready for you need to get the hell out of Dodge. Just fire at him. I copy. God, what is up with the, you and those medium lasers? Oh, these guys might finish him up. Come on, guys. Finish him off. Oh, somebody's shutting down. <laughs> oh, he's only got 61 heat on him. There, okay. <laughs> I take it back. Ow. Bye. Okay, guys. Uh, I'm going to cut the video here. And when the first mech goes out, I'll bring it back. And, um... We'll uh, continue on from there. All right, we'll be back in a second. All right, guys, welcome back. We're on a new turn here. Uh, these guys are just getting ready to go out. We're kind of in position here. I don't want to go into the cheater's position where we're like right up on where the enemy are going to be, uh, just because they got a free turn of like defenses. Yeah, so the only thing I hate about this what can I do for you? is Go that um, now all these mechs are going to be standing in that hex with their backs turned to the enemy. Alright, what do they got going on here? Four mechs, eh? Ghost, Osiris, Wolfhound, and a Jenner. Okay, not too bad. Oh, that's a clan Jenner. And he's going down to the kill box. Not exactly sure why, but whatever. Okay, we're going to reserve. They can't see us. Holding action, Commander. I'll take the... Uh, Hesitation. Come on, guys. That ghost is up there like, Hey, guys, they're just about to exit. We got to get going on this. And then he's just going to die. Well, maybe not. I don't think we got the juice to do that, but it'd be kind of nice if we could. The is just going to stay back here until these guys are out. There's no point in closing. Oh, 
How much armor do you got? Enough to shred? Oof. Yeah, I think we're going to kill the Osiris first. Those guys are going in the valley. I hear ya. And LK, LK, LK. Uh, let's just go LK. Oh, took his head off. He's got minus 13 initiative next round, though. These guys are almost out next turn, man. Ready for orders. Hunkering down. Um, uh, not gonna swarm this guy. Just gonna LK him. Whole lot of nothing. Ah, uh, you still need to wait there till that guy's out. Bracing for impact. God, I love that gas rifle pan on that guy. The seal arms didn't do much, no point in firing them again. Almost got this guy. Almost got this guy. Good to go. Okay, it should put him in good range here. Well, let's just fire. It's got a lot of damage reduction. Kind of waits like I'm point blank him. Okay, Wolfhound's going probably. Yeah. All right, Ghosty Bear, what are you doing? Alright. Fair enough. Ha! Send me a real Don't bonus. say things like that. That's what gets your ass killed. You know it, I know it, and they know it. Firing. Nicely done. Okay, I need to get Megasaur up here with the tags. Jenner, I think, moving? Yep. Okay, uh... Waiting for orders. Megasaur. Yeah. Just get in here. Just get in there. Yes, Commander. There we go. Finally got some direct line of sight on this guy. Uh, yep. Every little bit counts, I guess. We'll found. Oh. Uh-huh. <clears throat> kind of a smart play. Waiting on you, Commander. 
That is definitely dead fire range if I've ever seen it. Hammer time. Don't think he does. That's why he's backing up. Okay, we'll found it and then these guys can get out of here. And then we'll focus down these guys and we'll be done. Objective there they go. See you guys. See ya! Nice mirroring of the map here. Hammer him again. And there's more where that came from. Order. Somebody's unsteady. Let's get LOS on him. Swarm it up. And fire. It's going down. That's okay. Receiving you. Copy that. Let's finish this guy up. And then there were two. Wow, this is a long mission. This is a long mission. Well, they can probably see us now. What's up, boss? On my way. Double time. Yeah. Come on, guys. Yep, taking the instability. Want to finish this up and go home. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. There's more where that came from. Ooh. Waiting for orders. There we go. Double time. Let's go. Let's see if we can finish this guy up. Nope. Come on, guys. Let's go. Ladies, girls, women, people, you all, soldiers. Did I miss anything? Um. with a better chance to hit firing okay put them down yeah critical hit standing by i copy okay see if we can tag this guy oh yeah yep Hit him hard. Nice. Yes, Commander. Location confirmed. Hit him hard again. Almost out of LRMs here. We don't have any swarm left. All right, just firing. Nice. Reporting critical hit. Not the arm I wanted, but it's the arm I'm going to take. 
Yeah, I know you're out of bell rams. It's fine. Yeah, no, I think we just go on A. I was just going to fire on A here. LK or dead fire? Dead fire. And one acid. Alright, firing. This be good. Ah, I didn't even need the acid. Did you see that? Did you see it? I saw it. It's a Jenner barbecue. Is that the only mech that's taken damage so far? I'm thinking so. I'm thinking that's the only mech that's taken damage so far. Wait a minute. This guy could shoot me, but I can't shoot back? That's pretty fucky. That's pretty fucky, I gotta say. Ready for order. Confirmed. Locking on target. Waiting for order. I don't got all that much dead fire left. Well, LK's a better chance to hit. Maybe we finish him up. Let's fire. Well, we lost all the good stuff. Huh. Sucks that you moved over there right back into the fire. Okay, let's not do overkill here. See if we can save some components. There we go. Alright, let's go home. That was a long one. Mission successful. Well, at least the contract payment was increased by 30%. That's kind of nice for that long mission, 1 million. And, uh, yeah, Arena got a lot of kills, which is kind of weird for being a 35 ton support mech, but whatever. Alright, what do we got here? We can get another crab. We could get another crab eventually. If we choose two parts. ER mediums, triple plus flamer. We got two items we could take here. Heavy medium laser. We got a couple of these already, right? Yeah, we got three of them. Got a bunch of these already. MMLs. Got five of these. Case 2, Case 2 Clan, Claws. We've got three, but we're planning on getting two melee mechs going. Although, I don't think I can add two Claws to the Black Knight. I don't know. You know, it's going to be interesting to see. Maybe we bring those in. A DNI cockpit. Only got one right now. Endo Steel. Regular X. We lost an enhanced imaging the last episode. It's probably a good idea to replace that. Um, ah, a lot of good stuff here. Should have gone full salvage. But we needed this, we needed the sea bills, and I wasn't sure what we were going to get. Another sensor tracker here. Oh, these things are so good. That plus one accuracy. Gonna do that. Another virtual reality pod. Don't have any. Ah, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a tough choice. Um. I take it. 
the thing about this is that it's the uh, maximum evasion and evasion pips gained from movement. It's super handy for a mech that you got closing with the enemy. So let's go this route. Uh, Osiris and Wolfhound part. All right. Triple plus flamer. That's just kind of nice. Uh, and the rest is garbage, really. All right, finally, we got some stuff going on here, which is awesome. All right, guys, that was a long mission. So I am going to end the episode there. Let's get our task managed here first. I'll get everything back. Five days, we'll be back and running again. Actually, what I want to do... Ah, we'll leave it like this for now. Um, I was thinking about um, updating the Griffin with the uh, virtual reality and the uh, DNI cockpit, but we'll leave that for another time. Uh, we got 2.8 million C bills. We're almost at a point where we can bring that Black Knight forward and get that thing up and running. Uh, probably one more good mission should do it, and we should have enough C bills to hit our financial report, plus get the Black Knight up and running. So that's going to be the goal for the next episode. Uh, then we had the main lance roughly back in shape. I want to re-outfit everybody um, because if the Black Knight's going to be closing. I don't know. Do we want to go that route with the Black Knight? Let's think about this for a minute. If we go super melee on the Black Knight, well, yeah, we'll figure it out next episode. Just the sheer damage of that thing and just taking out mechs one at a time. Use everybody as long-range support, taking down all those those targets that are hitting the Black Knight. Yeah, I don't know. I'll have to see how it goes. All right, so we're going to leave the episode there. If you'd like to drop a like, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you later.